Leo, do not respond to those text messages from those exes coming during this Mercury retrograde, okay? Don't do it. Ten of Swords in reverse. Libra energy here with this Justice card in reverse. Do not do it, Leo. Unless it's the Leo in Portugal that needs to reach out to me. You just left the country and didn't text me back? Love you. For the rest of y'all, this Mercury retrograde is bringing these exes back. Ten of Wands in reverse action. Somebody you were very passionate with. I feel like that you have big history with, with this Justice card in reverse. This Nine of Swords, more air energy. Somebody that maybe ghosted you that doesn't want to address this elephant in the room. If you do answer that phone call, you might have been in a third party situation with them with this queen of wands here and this ace of pentacles in reverse now they want to come back talking about a commitment but not that third party situation this other this other oh hell no because with this queen of wands energy this is somebody who needs a lot of attention here this is somebody who is, needs the acknowledgement you're not going for this upside down offer here leo welcome back to my channel down to earth tarot these are your what you need to know messages okay please don't forget to like comment subscribe share this video um, let me know what's resonating for you. This could be love, work, or family related here. But with this, this is people, a blast from your past people, somebody, people that you have not spoken to. Maybe winding you up in a legal situation here. Maybe they had the cops called on you. You had to call the cops on them. But now they want to come back with some upside down commitment. What is that? What is this person sign? Drop it in the comment section. Underneath this queen of wands, clarifying this ten of swords is the free man or... <clears throat> Or the fool, excuse me, the first of the major arcana here, the start of a brand new journey. But this is somebody wanting a fresh start with you. And this is a fool you're familiar with, okay, with this ten of swords in reverse. This is somebody who either is trying to call you and you block them, or maybe you know that, Leo, they blocked you. You're, you're having to unblock them so you can read or respond to these messages. Why are you trying to talk to this person? Because you know that with this free man energy, while they may be free and single this week or during this little retrograde here, they got other things going on. They're not going to be here for a long time. Who is this person? And with this judgment here, underneath this justice card energy, you're going to have to make a major decision here with this person. Or maybe they're, or maybe they're getting ready. Oh, or did somebody make a major decision about them? rejecting them and that's why they're turning back around here during this time it didn't work out somewhere else and now they're trying to come back now you're looking good after all this virgo season virgo energy here with this hermit card okay <laughs> this is just a convenient season that somebody else rejected this person and now they're just looking for a home oh it's one of those people with this Ten of Wands being clarified by this Hermit energy here during this Virgo season and this retrograde, this person's coming back. They want to they wanna come over Netflix and chill. And if you let them Netflix and chill, they're never moving out, Leo. That's just your man. That's just your woman. Y'all live together now. They're couch surfing in a big way here. And with this Death card energy in reverse, transition, transformation, transition into your crib to your couch trying to be permanent here they're not wanting to address this uh elephant in the room here with this nine of swords being clarified by this death card in reverse mm -mm. they want a fresh start with you yes they want to move forward with you yes oh they want to move in they need a place to stay but they don't want to talk about whatever this was this upside down commitment here with this other person this fiery queen, this could be you. This could be this other person. Maybe uh, they were married or committed living with somebody else. Baby mama, baby daddy here. But this energy right here, they were committed to somebody else and not you. Yes. Third party energy with this three of wands now. All this wands energy and these upside down commitments. Earth fire energy. Leo, you. Third party energies trying to see where they can be here, there. They were putting themselves in a position where they couldn't lose. And now that this person's rejected them, they're back. And they don't have a choice here. That choice has been taken away from them, maybe, maybe from you, because you're not accepting this offer. Maybe from this other person here. But with this two of wands in reverse, 
this three of wands, this third party energy here, this commit upside down commitment. This person's money is upside down. Their situation is upside down. And that's why they're, they're, they want this commitment with you now. That's why they really want to talk to you. It's not, and even if it's not <clears throat> their finances, they're in a place where they don't have anybody else at the moment. And you're very convenient right now, Leo. Damn. Damn, who is this scumbag with the seven of pentacles earth energy here this is you taking a good look at this okay a good look at the situation here do i want to stay do i want to go what's their commitment versus mine and with this three and this four here let me get this light out of here you you can see that somebody's not as equally involved as you are in this situation here or they're just not headed in the same direction leo with the seven of pentacles really taking a look at where where you're at and where you're headed Clarifying this judgment underneath this Libra <clears throat> justice energy here in reverse. Somebody coming back that you've already made a judgment call on. You already know how you feel and where it's going to go and where it's not going to go. And Leo, here's your energy here. Okay? With the sun. The grass is greener on the other side here. Triumph. Happiness. This is things going your way. This is you wishing this person well. Because for some of you, you're just going to let this person go go back wherever it is that they came from. And while it was nice to hear from them, you're not really going to engage in this. Again, doubling down on that judgment call from before and turning them right back right back around. Uno, reverse. Keep, keep it moving. Keeping your distance from this person. But for some of you, maybe this is a judgment call and they've really made some changes. And you can take them back. And they've made change and you can move forward and ride off into the sunset together. But for a lot of you, you're going to leave the past in the past here. Underneath this Ten of Wands, this action, this person wanting to get into the house, Netflix and chill, because y'all are already familiar here. Turned your back on this person during this Virgo season. They want to come back with their bags packed, okay, wearing sweatpants, wearing very little, but they got a big bag. Mm -mm. And not trying to tell you about their situation here either with this Queen of Swords energy. Leo, you're going to have to use your mind over your heart here. This is you being logical over emotional here. Making a good <laughs> making good decisions here. Using your head, communicating what it is that you feel and what you know. Okay, to and giving an ultimatum here and creating some boundaries. Not allowing this person to just come back in with this Netflix and chill scheme and end up on your couch for a night and it end up being a year. No, no, no. You're going to set some clear boundaries here. It was nice to see you. It was nice to hang out with you, but you definitely have to go here. Okay. Some of you are going to be ghosting people with the seven of swords energy in reverse because there's, because when this person comes back, you may be giving them an opportunity here to clean it up, to have a second, op ch second chance with you. Could be a water sign person here or somebody who's very emotional here. We have this 10 of wands, Scorpio energy. So high emotions, very passionate here, matches your energy. But you may just have to ghost them because you know just starting a, <clears throat> starting a, a conversation or really meeting up with them in person, it's just not going to do you any good. That this person's actions haven't changed here. We have the justice card. We have the judgment here. Making a major decision here. Making a final judgment call here. And not only that, but you fully able to see this person in all these little games that they've been playing here. Because now that they're this free man, they've been stripped naked. This other person doesn't want anything to do with them either because of the, this these games that they've been playing, maybe they've figured out this third party situation that that's how this person likes to roll all the time here. You're ready to move on from this and walk away and just not give this person any type of communication. And they're going to talk about how they're feeling betrayed here. Taurus energy here with this five of pentacles, more Taurus energy here with this king of pentacles. And they're going to be very stubborn. They're going to be hanging around here again, making these offers of commitment that they're not going to follow through on. You already know that. Okay, talking about what they're going to do in the future here, what their plans are. They ain't got no plans. Now they got plans now, now that you're broken up, now that you don't want to talk to them. Now they got a five-year plan. Forget about it. That doesn't make any damn sense. And you know that with this three of swords, you know that they're sending you mixed signals here, that they're just lying through their teeth to keep you around. And you feel it's not that you don't have feelings for this person with this queen of swords energy. And that's not why you're having to set these boundaries. You have feelings for these persons and or these people. <clears throat> That's why you're having to set these boundaries. So you can continue to do you and not be held back by these things. And they're going to feel heartbroken, stabbed in the back, 
uh, abandoned, betrayed here by the, but you gotta do, you're doing what's best for you right now. And you gotta get out of this third party situation here. You could be dealing with a Pisces person with this three of cups, but this is you having other options here as well as this person putting you in these third party situations and that being the reason that you wanna be, be out and gone. New opportunities coming your way with this page of pentacles. So whether this is work, love, <clears throat> or family relationship related here, this, these are new opportunities and you're not willing to deal with these people or persons and be held back by these things and miss out on these opportunities. Cancer energy here, moving forward with balance and purpose. You could be traveling. That could be this movement. You could be moving out of state, moving out of the country, or just emotionally moving on from this situation here. And with this Four of Pentacles, setting your foundation somewhere else. For a lot of you, you're moving for work here. This is very much work-related, not getting um, the accolades or the acknowledgement where, where you're at and needing to move on. But for those of you that are, that are love-related, there's more opportunities somewhere else. There may be up more opportunities where people want to commit to you and give you what it is that you want. Maybe an older person here. Hey. Okay, Leo. Let me know how that resonated for you down in the comment section. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this, find me on Instagram, and I'll be checking in with you soon, Leo folks. Keep it real.